The new Reza Base 2.1 features a number of enhancements above and beyond the previous version 2.0. If you look under the Help menu and about we can see that the new version 2.1 of Reza Base offers a 64-bit version. If you have a 64-bit operating system, this will automatically get installed and allow you to run larger models with a uh, larger number of load combinations. Additionally, in Reza Base, if we take a look under the global parameters, we have a variety of additional steel and concrete design codes. Under steel design codes, you see you can now choose the AISC 14th edition for the design of your base plates and anchor bolts. And under concrete design codes, we can design the embed of your anchor bolts to the concrete using ACI 318 Appendix D. We have the 2005, 2008, and 2011 codes available. If you choose one of the newer codes, under the Anchor Bolts dialog screen you have a number of additional options, such as Seismic Design Category. This category, as determined by the ASCE7, determines whether the strength of your anchor bolts needs to be decreased for seismic loads, and whether your anchor bolts need to behave in a ductile manner. You can enable or disable these additional seismic checks by using the Seismic Category drop-down. Additionally, there's an anchor reinforcement checkbox that allows you to specify whether anchor reinforcement is present in your design. Anchor reinforcement is the design of rebar near your anchor bolts that's designed to develop the forces that are transferred through those anchor bolts. Therefore, all of the tension and shear that the anchor bolts are carrying into the concrete will immediately be developed into the reinforcement in the concrete. This prevents things such as cone failures in both the vertical and horizontal directions. If you open the load combination spreadsheet, the load generator now includes newer codes such as the 2012 IBC. And if we use the 2011 Appendix D code, you'll note under the Loads dialog box that we now notify you that for the 2011 code only, you need to ensure that your seismic loads, as you input them, have already been amplified by the overstrength factor omega naught as specified in ASCE7. When I solve the model, we can see here that we get a design of the base plate per the AISC 14th edition for both bearing pressure on the concrete and bending stress in the base plate. Additionally, we get AISC checks on the anchor bolts, and coming down a little farther here, we get the anchor bolt embed capacity for both steel, uh, cone breakout, pullout, side face blowout, pry out, and a variety of other failure modes. Ductility checks and the design of anchor reinforcement are also included. So I would encourage you to try out Reza Base 2.1.